On Sunday, July 24th, five girls and five boys competed for the title of the BVI's prestigious Prince and Princess 2016, respectively. Sophie B and Nia Douglas of JTV's Hot Trends recapped the memorable show as well as recalled some of the highlights of the winning performances. On Sunday, we had Prince and Princess mm -hmm. 2016, a fantastic show. I had the opportunity to host the show. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I just want to say hats off to the committee because it was a fantastic show. They started on time. It flowed very well, and mm -hmm. it was well organized. I had a really, really good time. And I think all the kids, 10 kids in all, did a fantastic job. Were you at the show? Yeah, I saw the footage, and I thought, like you said, all 10 kids did a really good job. I, obviously, there could only be two winners. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, I saw the dresses. I thought they were beautiful. And I thought, especially the princes, you know, because I think mostly the highlight is the little girls and seeing all the mm -hmm. fluffy dresses. But I really enjoyed seeing the style that the boys brought to the stage. So yes. that was a highlight for me. They were really dapper, mm -hmm. very dapper in their uh, tailored suits. They were mm -hmm. too sharp. And, you know, my favorite gown... I would have to say was, uh, I think her name was Ahasia, Number Ahasia four. Barth. Yeah. Um, it was depicting, I think it was an orchid. It was it was really gorgeous, pretty, yeah. very think, beautiful. Mm -hmm. And of course the winner, Miss um, Jada DeCastro, her mm -hmm. gown was also beautiful. I think these parents went all out, the chaperones went all out in terms mm -hmm. of preparing these kids. And what I realized is that we have such well-rounded children in the BVI and mm -hmm. I can see that the parents are really taking their time um, with the kids and helping them, you know, get their craft, get their talent a little bit better. Uh, mm -hmm. We had the winner, Prince um, Jonathan Hutchison. He played the drums for his talent and let me tell you, he ripped up them drums <laughs> in the cultural center. Let me mm -hmm. tell you, the people were on their feet, they were dancing. I think he played that gospel song, I'm walking mm -hmm. in power, I'm walking in miracle. And I was in the back there jamming. He did a, a fantastic job. Uh, at one point, he, he used only one stick to beat mm. the drum, and it was fantastic. And Jada, did you enjoy her her talent? Yeah, and um, it was about bullying, mm -hmm. I remember. So she tied it into her platform really well, if you could call it that. Mm -hmm. And I remember she had these two ribbons, and she was pulling back and forth. And it was just, it seemed really mature yes. for a little girl. But she executed it very well. I mean, it had a lot of emotion. Mm -hmm. But I thought she did a really good job in conveying that. And she kind of tied the bully and the victim together. And I thought it was, it was very deep. Yes. It was very deep. At one point, I was starting to get a little teary-eyed because, as you said, mm. it was really deep and you know you can see her passion in it mm -hmm. I think she's a trained dancer she's not just a regular dancer mm -hmm. you can see that she was trained and she did a wonderful job I think all the kids I just I wish all but well, all of them are winners mm -hmm. but if all of them could have been crown prince and princess that would have been neat but they mm -hmm. really did a fantastic job and all of them did walk away with a crown a participant they did. crown I mm -hmm. love how they do that you know so none of them mm -hmm. feel like you know they they did all of that work for, for absolutely nothing so mm -hmm. how Hats off to the committee once again. You guys did a fantastic job. Janine, Jean-Louis, and your team. Uh, thank you for having me as a host. Also, shout out to Shane Leibert. He was there with me as well. He was the co-host for the evening and did a fantastic job as well. You can watch the entire Prince and Princess 2016 pageant right here on JTV Channel 55.